Hey everybody, welcome to Leon's Chainsaw Parts and Repair. We are looking at a Home Light 150 automatic that's going to go in my collection. Uh, so this all came about kind of by by strange circumstance. Uh, I had sold Mike a uh, a super easy, not quite two years ago, and I guess he's been having a little bit of trouble with it. Um... Uh, so we agreed, yeah, we don't know for certain that it's carburetor issues, but he wanted to send me uh, the carb I had on it and then an extra one to go through just to make double certain that everything was good. So that and a few parts that he needed were in trade for this 150 automatic that his dad had that has, has no more need for. And initially I'm like, oh yeah another 150 I don't really need that but then you know he sent pictures oh, I don't have this variant so yeah there's some paint loss there's definitely some paint loss and this isn't the bar that came with it I, I put that up it's a, a hard nose bar that's got some pretty good wear but I figured what the hell I'll throw it up there for stump cutting or something put a sprocket nose on this and yeah but She's got damn good compression, so despite being caked with junk on the inside and all of that, able to get it running. So, it's a little rough, but we're going to put a nice, well-used 1973 150 automatic in the collection. But let's fire it up, take a listen. This will help me test to make sure I've gotten all the carburetor gremlins worked out. Not bad. Not bad at all. Thank you, Mike. This saw is going in the collection.